I tried Gears of War 5, so you don't have to. And let's just say I may have saved you from this. Bap, babbity, map, crap, nappity, wabbity. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. So yeah, let's just say you can thank me later. However, I did have a lot of fun myself playing Gears 5, and you might find enjoyment from playing it as well. Uh, hopefully you guys stick around to see some of the reasons I had a lot of fun playing the game, and yeah, let's get right into the video. So yeah, as I was saying, I had a lot of fun playing this game. The whole experience. At first, all I did was play casual, which is where I got these first couple of clips in. I just liked it because it was easy to pick up the sniper and play with, which reminded me of how I used to have fun playing the old gears. So in this clip, you can see I'm starting to get a little bit more acclimated with the movement of the game. It's starting to get a little bit easier for me. I'm just having a good time learning the game. Triple kill! That you were imitating. No way, I killed this dude. Oh, I traded with him! <laughs> I'm shitting on people. Where are you? I literally already got four kills. This clip is so fire to me because I went off with the sniper. I think I killed four or five people here within the span of like 45 seconds. Give me that head, boy. How does that? Oh, I downed him. Oh. Nice little three piece. So after a while of playing the game, naturally I had a few people coming through my stream telling me about wall bouncing. I had never heard of wall bouncing, but somebody explained it to me and well, I think this clip pretty much explains itself. So yeah, that's wall bouncing in the most basic form. But once I learned that, I started going off. This is probably my best clip from my time playing competitive. So yeah, that was pretty sick. That was like six or seven dudes over the course of like 30 seconds. Pretty nuts. But pay attention to the movement in these next couple of clips. That's what really sets them apart for me. It's sick.
Gears can even produce funny moments that lead to good content like this. There's a laser on this map, right? And if you get touched by the laser, you die. And it's right in the middle of the map and it led to a funny end to one of the rounds we played and ended up clutching out because the laser helped us out in the end. It's pretty funny. Let's go. Good work. We got it. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, I'm down. I'm down. Gimme, 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 gimme. Watch out. Yes. No, the laser. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming. No! The laser! Yes! The la What's the score? Monka, no! There it is. Yeah. There it is. Count it up, boys. Laser. Let's go. Come on, boys. So, all in all, my over impression of the game is it's really fun. The movement is top tier. The shooting mechanics can be a little clunky at times. It's definitely something you have to get the hang of. Personally, I would put the game somewhere between a seven and an eight out of 10. If you agree with me or disagree with me, feel free to leave a comment below and we can keep the conversation going. And don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you're new. And if you got any other games that you want me to try so that you don't have to, feel free to drop them in the comments below and we might play your game next. So thanks for watching and take it easy.